I'm probably best known for writing uh, police thrillers, um, urban police thrillers, violent urban police thrillers with um, extreme criminals in them and sometimes um, cops who are only as good as they have to be. No, tell us about your latest book, Never Seen Again. What's the plot? Never Seen Again was um, an, an ode to my friends in journalism rather than my friends in the police. All my previous uh, novels have been, most of my previous novels have been about coppers. This, I thought it's about time, I gave a nod towards the guys and gals in the newsroom. Um, so it was about a, 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 a journalist, a, an ambitious crime reporter, who gets too close to the action. It's a pretty intense book, isn't mm. it? Yeah. I know that three artists have been challenged to transform or interpret this book into a single painting. Well, it's a dream come true. Uh, a, a, a small group of artists um, who, who are not really known to me, or they certainly weren't known before, all agreed to have a go, and it was going to be a competition. Who And I, and I would judge the competition, which is no small thing in itself. I mean, the, the strange thing is, it, to be asked to judge the competition with the three artists standing there, is going to be really, really difficult. Well, Paul, the next stage is I'll see you in Birmingham. See you in Birmingham. I can't wait. We don't know what his taste is like. We don't know what he's got his hat... Because he wrote the book and he's got imaginations of what these people look like and the places which look like. So there's no competition between ourselves. I've tended to go for realism and it's because I'm influenced by um, the Pre-Raphaelites in Birmingham Museum. Um, I've always liked them and they're really bright colours so I do tend to use quite luminous colours as well. That's great. I mean, considering I'm not actually a reader but once I got into it, it really you really get into it, don't you? And it takes you off, you know. I mean, they all speak to me. I mean, every single one of you has nailed it. This just slightly has the edge. Uh, the painting I have chosen is painting number one. Wow. Congratulations. Wow. Bro. Thank you, Helen. I, I, what can I say? It's, I mean, that, I love them all. I really love them all. You've done the most astonishing deep dive into the book. Saw Jodie looking at me. <laughs> the key character in the book. And that look is come and find me. Well earned that, Helen. Thank very, you. very well. Thank you. It's been an absolute pleasure. I've enjoyed it Thank and I'm really happy that you're pleased. Um, so yeah, it's just brilliant. It's been really enjoyable. It's meant a lot to me um, and it's just a fantastic opportunity and we're all winners.